If you have tree frogs around your home and you or your children enjoy watching them, then making and installing tree frog tubes may be an activity you would enjoy. Several species are known to use tree frog tubes, but the green tree frog will likely be the most common species in Texas. To begin, you'll need a section of PVC pipe with an inside diameter of 1 inch and a minimum length of 2 feet. You'll need a pipe cap of the same material that fits snugly and securely over your pipe. You can get both of these items in the plumbing section of your local hardware store. You'll also need a hammer, a nail, paint if you choose to paint your tree frog tube, and a drill and two drill bits. One should be a 16th inch drill bit and the other just needs to be larger than the diameter of the head of your nail. Once you have your materials, slip the pipe cap onto whichever end of the tube you determine will be the bottom. Make sure it fits tightly because it'll have to hold water. Glue in the pipe cap in place is not recommended because you may want to remove the cap to clean the tube in the future. Once the cap's in place, measure 5 inches up the tube from the bottom and drill a 1 16th inch hole into the side of the tube. This hole will allow the tube to drain when rain fills it while allowing a small reservoir of water to remain in the bottom. This reservoir of water provides the moisture the frogs need to survive. Next, measure 1 inch from the top of the tube and using the other drill bit, drill a hole into the side to hang the tube. If you choose to paint your tree frog tubes to disguise the white PVC, only paint the outside and ensure that the paint you select adheres to PVC. To mount your tree frog tube, drive a nail into a tree trunk, fence post, or other vertical structure at chest height or higher. Then hang the tube. Add water to the tube to fill the reservoir at the bottom and wait. If you're fortunate, you'll have frogs in your tree frog tubes within days.